Hi, my name is Juan Pantoja, I'm a professional makeup artist in Central Florida. And today I'm going to show you how to do a witch makeup, how to create your own look. Um, we start with a green base, we use an airbrush makeup, we use the airbrush to create the, the entire look to get it very soft. But you can use this with any cream based products or regular makeup that you can find around. Um, the idea is to get everything nice and blended and smooth it out. We stop at the face here because of demo purposes, but you want to create and, and cover everything, even the ears and the back of the neck, everything that you see skin, you want to cover with the green. And now we're going to start contouring and creating that character. Right now it's just a, a green canvas, that's how I would say. So first I'm going to start with the yellow. To create a nice soft highlight. Let's see, if, since the face is green, we want to highlight with yellow instead of using white. You can use a frosty, um, shimmery white or gold over the green if you want something a little bit more glamorous. Just to create some contours on the face. So I'm using the airbrush. You always want to keep it at least four to six inches away so everything goes very smooth. You don't want any color to be just sitting in one spot. The purpose of using the airbrush is just to have everything blended. I'm going to grab a more like a terracotta color. Um, it's kind of like a reddish brown to create some contours. You can do it freehand or you can have like your hand or a piece of tissue paper to create the contour if you want it more defined. But for this purpose we want everything really nice, softly blended. Got a little bit of contour here on the temples. We're probably going to be using a wig over the makeup. So we can stop the makeup. We don't have to do a lot of details in this area because that wig is going to cover it. Or the hat. I'm going to be using water activated makeup for creating all the textures and lines and details of the witch. And we're going to start creating some lines. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to shake the excess of the color off. I want to have a lot of paint. Cora is a witch, so let's add some words here. Let's put one right here. Let's put one right here. Oh, those beauty marks are so awesome. I'm going to create some detailings with the airbrush. Now, for this part, I'm going to go closer because I'm going to create some lines, so I want to create more then fade it areas. Close your eyes. Mix with a little bit of the brown to enhance those shades. And to finish up our witch, let's do a bright fuchsia lip. This is how you can create a nice, wicked looking witch. A very sexy eye makeup, nice bright lips, nice contour, and a very green base. Have fun with it. My name is Juan Pantoja, and I'm a professional makeup artist in the Central Florida area.